It's called The Last Rites and Fluctuating Personae of the Pornographic Film Star, 13 Pleasures, circa 1980. Okay. Love at the intersection, subway car humid, varying to chilly, starting to nod out, head steps back to awake. They would probably just want some areas to play with. They did not say, and they probably never will. Fondling beasts and fingering orgiastic still lives. Together we would join in our desperate obsession with turning on the water in the mouth. Spit it out. The word in the image etched on her ass cheeks. Spread apart just a little, she found this exciting as she hummed to herself. To make one as tasty as this was a grand accomplishment, and she knew it. Because the beasts craved my body, that's why. They drooled my light when I lay down naked under the black stars. I was humming old blues songs from the Delta in my sexy, raspy voice. My black fingernails fingering my freshly washed and watched pussy. I know that's what they wanted, my Burmese tiger trap. As soon as they got close enough to steal a lick, the spears slowly pierced them. It was a slow death since all the vital organs were missed, but it was oh so delightful, and their limbs twitched so quietly, it was almost like prayer. No video, only 16 millimeter. Panties had effectually been killed. The skirt generated questions. Her autobiography was shaky. It's the authentic American words for her. God bless. They won't be laughing nervously again. She remarked that they wanted to pass through her mind of naked strangers. Up there, threatened with power and control, take one of her crimes and all of her biological time games. Intoxicating touch of burnt fingerprints. This is fun. Let's do it. Fuck roughly. Murder them sweet and gently. Sweet and low, seething eyes. Take the face of a saint to present it to that everyday pedestrian. Burn it off with an acetylene torch. Laugh, whimper, in so deep. Please use me. She was dying to give the strangers the scoop on her nocturnal neighbors. She was a nocturnal animal herself. She had no doubts about her lifestyle while fluttering into bedrooms on silent wings. She hit the love jackpot. She will use our environment to our advantage. Us humans would fuck on the traffic lights and touch each other in private places. We were ready to spring into action as she lifted her skirt in an obvious fashion. She made her statements to no one in particular. The jury had committed suicide. I've lost balance and it makes me happy. She went down and continued for upwards of 20 years as a dress bled milk. Her smiles had been disguised. She took the jewelry of the corpses to church and made a donation since the original owners wouldn't need them anymore. Her lovers had become props discarded at 6 a.m. Epigram of suicide songs. Why not now? If you speak of her, she will always appear. Her hand drifted under the table, smell of skin and painful memories of several days ago came rushing backwards in full focus. Fingers dancing entwined in hair, rushing blood cold sweat. I've lost balance and it makes me happy. Thank you. Wow. Good